And now a message from the Gustavostifer. These days, things are really tough. And I know it can be hard to keep yourself motivated. And I know a good majority of you out there are depressed. And you wake up every morning thinking to yourselves, why? What am I doing? Where am I going? Why is there a dead hooker in my bed? Well, I'm here to let you know that there are other people out there feeling exactly like you. You're not alone. There are other people out there losing hope, feeling things may never get better. Other people caught in existential funks, starting every day wondering if today is going to be their last day on this earth. You're not alone. There are people out there that find themselves staring into the sky, asking, when am I going to get my break and finally get that suit made entirely out of burritos? That's just me. There's people across the world feeling those feelings of inferiority stemming from that time when you were six years old and you drank the red paint in the garage because you thought it was red Kool-Aid. And who can really blame you? I mean, it looked like red Kool-Aid. And why would you not drink something that looks like red Kool-Aid? And you're six years old. How are you supposed to be able to read and be able to tell that that's red paint, not red Kool-Aid? They should have made it more obvious. They should have put like a big skull and crossbones on there or something so that kids really know that this is something you're not supposed to be doing. They do that? They, they put that... Oh. Okay, well they should have made it even more obvious or they should have not made it taste so yummy. Who's really to blame if you found you enjoyed the taste of the red paint and so you just kept drinking it and drinking it and drinking it until you moved out of the house at 18 and then once you moved out of the house at 18 you just kept buying it and kept drinking it and that led to permanent brain damage which led to those feelings of inferiority which you're now feeling. You're not alone. There are other people out there feeling your anger and your pain. What? That's just... That's just me too. That son of a bitch. Many people cry themselves to sleep at night wondering why. Why did I eat six pounds of peanuts and drink a whole pot of coffee? Feels like my stomach's shitting out my intestines. Who hasn't found themselves drinking blood and finding horse gerrymandering is quite popular. You got a tube of chewed pretzels going to the store all only for one dollar. You're not alone. There's other people out there just like you that are going through the exact same things that you are. So chin up. Everything is going to be fine. Dear Gust of Osprey, I've been a fan for years now and I love everything you've put together. That's so nice. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now that that's out of the way, why are you so ugly? Sincerely, eat well, I could treat you right, girl. I could serenade you with song like. Oh, God damn it!